Hello everyone, welcome to our YouTube channel Curious Minds Canada. In this video, we are going to see the question and answers of Class 6 the Science Chapter 7 Temperature and its Measurement. First one, the normal temperature of a healthy human being is close to Option 1 98.6 degrees Celsius, 37 degrees Celsius. 32 degrees Celsius and 27 degrees Celsius. The correct answer is option 2, 37 degrees Celsius. Second question, 37 degrees Celsius is same temperature as dash. Option 1, 97.4 degree Fahrenheit. Second option, 97.6 degree Fahrenheit. Third, 98.4 degree Fahrenheit. Fourth, 98.6 degree Fahrenheit. The correct answer is option 4, 98.6 degree Fahrenheit. Third question, fill in the blanks. First one, the hotness or coldness of a system is determined by its dash. Answer, temperature. Second one, the temperature of ice cold water cannot be measured by a dash thermometer. Answer, clinical. Third one, the unit of temperature is degree dash. Answer Celsius. Fourth question. The range of a laboratory thermometer is usually dash. Option 1 10 degree Celsius to 100 degree Celsius. Second option minus 10 degree Celsius to 110 degree Celsius. Third one 32 degree Celsius to 45 degree Celsius. Fourth one, 35 degrees Celsius to 42 degrees Celsius. The correct answer is option 2, minus 10 degrees Celsius to 110 degrees Celsius. Fifth question, four students used a laboratory thermometer to measure the temperature of water as shown in the figure 7.6. So, they have given here how the students use the laboratory thermometer and who do you think followed the correct way for the measuring temperature. Here, option 2, that is student 2 used the correct way to measure the temperature. Sixth question, color to show the red column on the drawing of thermometers figure 7.7 .7, as per the temperatures written below. So, here I have colored in the red to show the 14 degree Celsius, 17 degree Celsius and 7.5 degree Celsius. You can do it as the same in your textbook. Seventh question. Observe the part of thermometer shown in figure 7.8 and answer the following questions. First one, what type of thermometer is it? Answer is the laboratory thermometer. Second question, what is the reading of the thermometer? Answer 26 degrees Celsius. Third one, what is the smallest value that this thermometer can measure? Answer is 1 degree Celsius. Eighth question. Laboratory thermometer is not used to measure our body temperature. Give reason. Answer. Laboratory thermometer has wide range of temperature and it does not contain kink near its bulb. So, when we remove the thermometer from the mouth, the mercury level may fall down and hence it will not show a proper value. Therefore, we cannot use a laboratory thermometer to measure our body temperature. Ninth question. Vaishnavi has not gone to school as she is ill. Her mother has kept a record of her body temperature for 3 days as shown in the table 7.4. This is the table. Now, what was Vaishnavi's highest recorded temperature? As you can see, it is 40 degrees Celsius. Second question. On which day and at what time was Vaishnavi's highest temperature recorded? Answer. On first day at 7 p.m. The highest temperature is recorded. Third question. On which day did Vaishnavi's temperature return to normal? Answer. On third day, Vaishnavi's temperature returned to normal. Tenth question. If you have a, uh, to measure the temperature 22.5 degrees Celsius, which of the following three thermometers will you use in the figure 7.9? So, here 
which thermometer you are going to use you have to tell to measure 22.5 degree celsius and the correct answer is thermometer b 11th one the temperature shown by the thermometer in the figure 7.10 is option 1 28 degree celsius option 2 27.5 degree celsius option 3 26.5 degree celsius option 4 25.3 degree celsius and the correct answer is option 2 27.5 degree celsius 12th question a laboratory thermometer has 50 divisions between 0 degree celsius and 100 degree celsius what does each division of this thermometer measure answer is each division measures 2 degree celsius 13th one draw a scale of a thermometer in which the smallest division reads 0 0.5 degree celsius you may draw only the portion between 10 degree celsius and 20 degree celsius so you can draw this thermometer in your notebook 14th question Komal tells you that she has a fever of 101 degrees does she mean it on the celsius scale or fahrenheit scale answer she tells in fahrenheit scale extra questions now we will see first main fill in the blanks with appropriate words first one the si unit of temperature is dash answer is kelvin second one the dash thermometer is used for measuring body temperature answer clinical third one 37 degrees celsius is the same temperature as dash uh, 98.6 degree Fahrenheit fourth question the temperature of ice cold water can be measured by a dash thermometer answer laboratory fifth one normal temperature of a healthy human adult is taken to be dash 37 degree Celsius second main state whether the following statements are true or false first one a hotter body has a higher temperature than a colder body true second one the si unit of temperature is degree celsius false third one clinical thermometer is used for measuring the temperature of boiling water false fourth one a laboratory thermometer is used to measure our body temperature false third main match the following so boiling point of water it is 100 degree celsius freezing point of water 0 degree celsius digital thermometer runs by battery 0 kelvin is absolute 0 liquid metal mercury fourth main answer the following questions first question define the word temperature answer the reliable measure of hotness or coldness of a body is called its temperature second question which liquid is generally used in thermometer answer the liquid generally used in thermometer is mercury third one how many kinds of thermometers are there name them answer there are two kinds of thermometers clinical thermometer and laboratory thermometer fourth question mercury thermometers are being replaced by digital thermometers give reason answer mercury is an extremely toxic substance and is difficult to dispose if thermometer breaks accidentally so mercury thermometer are being replaced by digital thermometer fifth question why is mercury used in thermometer answer mercury is used in thermometers because it can expand and contract evenly when the temperature changes it is shiny it does not stick to glass tube mercury stays in liquid form in a wide range of temperatures sixth question write differences between clinical thermometer and laboratory thermometer answer in clinical thermometer it is made made specially for measuring human body temperature laboratory thermometer it is used to measure temperature of liquids 
Clinical thermometer range is from 35 degree Celsius to 42 degree Celsius. Laboratory thermometer range is minus 10 degree Celsius to 110 degree Celsius. Clinical thermometer kink is present. In laboratory thermometer kink is not present. Seventh question. Describe the steps to use a laboratory thermometer. Answer. The correct way of measuring thermometer using a laboratory thermometer is first one when the thermometer is immersed in water its bulb should not touch the bottom or sides of the beaker the thermometer should be held vertically should not be tilted the temperature must be read while the temperature is emerged in liquid while reading the thermometer the eye should be directly in line with the level of liquid so these are the question and answers that uh, they have given in your NCRT textbooks and also you have seen the extra questions which are uh, related to this chapter. I hope this video is useful for you all. If yes, please like our video and uh, if you have not yet subscribed our channel, please subscribe it and please share our video. Thank you.